<clears throat> and now, in my never-ending struggle to uplift these proceedings, here are two distinguished professors, Drs. Arnold Nude and Frederick Nick, to discuss post-Dickensian economics. Mm. Okay, okay, okay. Tell him the story. Yeah, yeah, sure. yeah, yeah. Give yeah, me yeah. a break, will you? Uh, okay, <laughs> The best explained post Dickensian whatever else. Whatever. Uh, economics. <laughs> Let me tell you a little story. Yeah, tell him the story. Oh. I'm trying. I am trying to tell him a story. Shh. <laughs> Once upon a time, there was a man named Benny. What else? What else? <laughs> who was visited by his fairy godmother. Fairy godmother? Fairy godmother. Yeah. Now, Benny's fairy godmother <laughs> promised him that he would live forever on a one condition, see, that he never, never shave again. Never shave. Isn't that some condition? <laughs> now, Benny never shaved after that. And you know what? What, what, what? He lived to be 175 years old. No! <laughs> now, one day, Benny met a beautiful girl. Uh, it happens to anyone. Yeah. And he fell in what? Love. Yeah, very bright. Love. No. And a beautiful girl asked Benny to shave his beard off. No. And when a furry godmother heard oh, yeah, that yeah. Benny had shaved, yeah, yeah, yeah. why, she got that man. Man. <laughs> She turned Benny into a Grecian iron. Yeah, yeah, and, and that only goes to prove the economic theory. A Benny shave is a Benny iron. Ah! <laughs>